job, what the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck, oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say. What the deal, how you feel, not important. All I'm thinking about is riding in these Porsches, but don't be coming at me with that horse shit. Acting like you know me, that's the worst shit. I know in my soul. I have had a good breakfast, I've worked out, I've showered, I've had a shower, this is my outfit for today. So I'm going to use um, these ones by Pitke. Oh, it's going to be cold. Oh. oh, it's so cold. I just worked out and I got out of the shower and I was still feeling really hot. So this is actually really cooling me down. Okay. Ta-da! I always put the rest on my hands. Um, you can actually get hand ones now, but that would freak me out. <laughs> Done. See you guys in 15. Ta-da! Cute! Oh my god, it smells really, really good. legit 7 a.m and oh my god wait i'm so tired my, my armchair has arrived which i wasn't expecting i thought i wasn't going to be here for another couple days i was literally fast asleep it really doesn't let anyone at all like um through the building so they called me but they call you off of like a separate phone and it's really loud and it's like what the fuck is going on oh my god i've got the chair out of the box and i'm just kind of moving the room around a little bit so wait let me put the light on the in that corner i had the like palm tree thing um so i did have the chair over here which where i was originally gonna put it because of like the books that would be here and like the neon sign i thought it would look quite cute but i think the front of it is just so beautiful i want to be able to walk in and see it rather than seeing the back of it. So I've moved it over here right now. I have this like dried pampas grass thing that I've put there. And from here, I actually really like that. I think it might need something green, but I like the fact, it's just kind of hard to imagine what everything will look like when there are literally no books on the bookshelf. So it looks really odd. The picture hasn't been hung yet. The neon sign hasn't been hung yet. So I'm kind of like trying to arrange it while still keeping those things in mind. But I am really happy of how it looks so far. This chair is freaking gorgeous. I'm so obsessed. This was the one that was in my come shopping with me. And I was like, I just want a, a casual beige chair, really big. Um, so it's from Julian and Joseph. I'm going to link it down below. The quality compared to the price, I am so shocked. Like it looks so luxurious. It's so thick and big and heavy. It's coming back. It just felt too bad. I need a book club. After a FaceTime call with my grandparents, because of grandparents know best, this is how I've decided to keep it, and I'm actually really happy with it. I think it looks good. Whilst I'm here, I just realized this was here that I wanted to talk about because I put this on my story, and so many of you guys were saying that you wanted to order it, you had no idea how it works, so I'm going to explain it quickly. So this is what I got in my heat box this month. A lot of you guys want one of the boxes, but you just have no idea how it works. Um, and there was a little bit of questioning about whether the stuff was authentic or not. So yes, it 100% is authentic. Authentic. reason why, number one, you don't know what's in the box. And number two, why it is so affordable for um, stuff that's so expensive is because they pick stuff at random from factories that have overproduced stock and are not allowed to sell it in store. Obviously, my birthday was a couple weeks ago and I really wanted a new bag. I just, I couldn't come to like a decision on which one I wanted. And now... I have this gorgeous baby. Oh my God, I'm so obsessed. The reason why I really like these, I'm not pay being paid to say this by the way, it sounds very like sponsored. Um, but another reason why I love these boxes as well is because you have stuff that you would never usually buy or look into. Like I have a few off white hoodies, but I would never think of getting a bag from them. This is perfect. Like this is exactly what I wanted. I wanted a black bag. I wanted something a little bit smaller, um, slightly dressy because a lot of my bags are either like to travel with or um, just like a little bit more casual. This is freaking 
gorgeous i'm so obsessed now <laughs> after my little chair palava oh my god so cute i'm gonna make some breakfast it's only like 9 a.m <laughs> breakfast is served i'm also watching daytime tv because it's just like the best thing and i'm so happy i actually have a chance to watch it right now so i thought i would show you guys my wardrobe well the one in my bedroom i have one here then i also have this one too which i'm not going to show you now because it's not really finished yet and then i have um another little one by my door this is like the main one in my wardrobe and i think i want to change it around a little bit so i thought i'd show you at first i don't think i've ever shown you guys it so I thought I'd show you it. Okay, so obviously, disclaimer, I have a real thing about color coordinating my clothes. Let's change this around a little bit. I have this section here where I've kept most of my shoes. Um, and then this is just a mess up here. Like, they were all in sections like the jeans, but they keep like collapsing on each other. So I have to have some drawers built in at the bottom and then get some shelving so my shoes will sit in like shelves at the top. Oh, the sensor's gone off. Hello. There we go. I think that will be the next task. I also get a lot of questions on my suitcases. They're from Away. I'm gonna link them down below. This one is huge. Like, I think it's the biggest suitcase I've ever had in my life. So good. This small one here actually charges your phone. It has like a little port, which is so helpful because this is the one you take on the plane. And a lot of planes, especially if you're like traveling around Europe, don't have ports for you to charge anything. So it's really, really helpful. So I just realized I haven't even shown you guys my neon sign and I'm obsessed. I put it on my Instagram story um, and I think I just forgot to film it. But how cute is this? I'm a brand called Neon Beach. There's so many neon signs. You can also get custom ones as well. Like you customize the color, the font. I'm still delivering throughout everything going on. So if you wanted to spruce up your room a little bit, but I'm going to turn it on. Three. Oh my god, I feel like I'm turning on like Christmas lights or something. Three, two, one. Oh. Yay! Ta-da! Oh my god, I love it so much. Honestly, the quality is so nice. You guys all know I used to love my pink one that I had in my room for so long. And I was planning on bringing it here, but it smashed whilst I was taking it down, which is fun. It's no secret that my vocabulary is kind of limited. And I say, oh for real, I'm obsessed and so cute about 52 times a day. So this is just like perfect for in the house. For the living room, I'm determined to make this a cozy like reading area. Please ignore the bookshelf because it's actually giving me anxiety that it's not filled yet. Uh, anyways, bigger things going on in the world, okay. It also comes with a remote and you can change the brightness and you can set a timer, which is really helpful. My last one didn't do that. Um, and I don't know, I'm just so lazy. Sometimes you just can't be bothered to get up and unplug something. Remote, I just think it's so cute. <laughs> Love it. Okay, I'm gonna charge my camera for a bit. Good morning. Okay, so I remembered that I didn't show you guys my espresso machine yesterday. I don't know, I wasn't feeling very well last night and I was getting really scared. I was like, oh my God, I hope everything's okay. But I'm feeling better this morning. Make sure you're looking after your immune system. Even if you're by yourself, it's important. Instagram story yesterday and a lot of you guys wanted a link so I'm gonna link it down below but look how cute my new coffee machine is I think it's so cute and a lot of you guys actually sent me this one to buy because I was saying I wanted a matcha latte machine this model here actually um takes matcha latte capsules i'm gonna link the ones on amazon that i buy it honestly tastes like a professional matcha latte that you can like buy buy on your way to your meetings in the morning you know i miss that i miss the lifestyle i really do i'm gonna have a coffee this morning because i have to edit this video and i need some kind of energy what color should i go for today um let's go with gold i don't even know what this one is wait let me get them out oh my god yum i'm gonna go with the gold one because i just read that it's caramel and then it's also got this little frother as well i think this is actually sold out which um is insane but i'm gonna link it down below and hopefully you guys i'm just pouring the milk in can get it soon if you did want it i feel like when everything is back to normal as well it's gonna save me so much money because i get a matcha latte every single morning and now i can just make them at home oh my god look how professional i am this is cute, okay. I get so excited about the frothy milk. Why is that? I don't know. Oh my god, yum, this is like an actual latte, I can't deal. If you want me to show you how I make the matcha ones, then just let me know. Obviously it's just a capsule, but if you want to see me do it, or maybe even an iced one, then let me know and I can show you. I'll show you the view because my windows need cleaning. Oh my god, look at my hair. I have a hair mask in my hair right now. This room for me, like, oh, I just can't wait till it's all done and I can relax in here. I love the light in here. Like, as you can tell, the lighting is just, like, 
so dreamy and like cream and oh i'm so obsessed i'm gonna be putting all of that together over the next couple days i wanted to wait until it was all here and i could do it all at the same time so um not this sunday i'm gonna be putting up a styling video this sunday next sunday i'm gonna upload my bedroom transformation okay so i'm gonna end the vlog here i really need to wash out this hair mask it's literally been in my hair for like way too long <laughs> i really need to wash it out but i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna see you again on sunday if you guys enjoyed this video um if you did remember to like it and subscribe if you haven't already i will see you on sunday make sure you take care and we'll see you soon